I'm just going to get a smaller, cheapy little brush and start filling in some of the holes that were created when I melted my piece. This is kind of fun doing this um, on the head camera side so that uh, you can see a little bit closer. My, my craft cam, I don't know why, it's just that the lighting or something, I'll have to get that fixed. But so you can just see I'm just filling in some of these with my metallic and I'm probably going to want to use maybe a sparkle something to really give it a nice little glimmer maybe a focal point right now the focal point you'll see is in the middle with that big hole that's in the middle and you're going to get that when you're doing these scrunched up ones so you just want to make sure that your focal point isn't too blatant and awkward, whereas this one kind of does. This one kind of looks awkward. So we'll probably want to put something in the middle here that creates a better focal point rather than just having a hole there. So I'm just going to actually cover most of what's clear with this metallic bronze. It doesn't matter if it's, you know, a little bit clear. It's, it's a sheer bronze, so it's not going to, you know, mute out too much of that really pretty kind of oceany blue, but it's going to sort of let that peek through and give you a really neat little look. And then I might also go through there maybe with a, a different color, like maybe even a, a pink or, you know, something, something a little wacky there. All right, so that's our second coat, and you can see how that's looking sort of far away. Yeah, Laura, I do. This show is actually recorded, and what's great is it doesn't just record my video, but it also records the chat. So if people are chatting about things and it's kind of going by super fast, it will record the chat so that you can go back and see what people were saying along with the video, which is really cool. And that's, that's why we love uh, having this program. Okay, let me, you know, I'm just getting a little antsy because I only have two colors on here. And this is, you know, this is all just sort of the creative, super creative process. And it's all up to you, but like I said, three colors, probably your best bet for this type of project. And um, use different techniques, like the third accent color. You're probably going to want to use um, maybe dabs of it on there instead of just painting it on there, or, or maybe a little bit more of a dry brush technique. And really, uh, maybe just along the ridges, that kind of thing. So it's sort of coming together here. And think about your outfits. You know, if you're making this for yourself, think about what types of colors normally go in your outfits. I know it looks a little strange that I have teal and uh, magenta and bronze on here, but unfortunately, this, these are the colors that I usually wear together. So, <laughs> so that is how that all came together for me. Let's see. Yes, it is, Terry. Thank you so much. It is all about having fun with crafty friends and. Usually, um, I'm, I'm burning myself, <laughs> or um, we're all laughing together about something completely random and stupid, or just random and crafty and fun, and it's really just about connecting and having a really fun time with all of our crafty friends. 